Hi, I'm doing this video just to give you an insight into what it's like to be a car to bus driver. Your shifts can vary anything from starting at 4 o'clock in the morning till finishing half past 11, 12 o'clock, half past 12 at night. Driving is the devil. You see there's some buses already leaving. Yeah, let's bang in my can. Bang my can, the devil no one. I walk down to the sign on. All the diesel buses. Well the majority of them are packed outside. Yeah. And one of these doors to sign on. On the right side. Yeah. Sign on, you get a ticket telling you about your duty. You pick up the car. So do you use the fish, you use the checks. And you also pick up your pad with all your timing points, all your running times. Just walk through the depot now to go and get on my bus and check it out. In the next part of the depot, so this is where all electric buses are The lanes are numbered, starting with one there. All the way up to the lanes outside as well. That's the paint shop over there. And other workshops in the door shop. As you can see, I've come outside now. Lane mankins are on the fence there as well, and on the floor. This is my best for the day. Bus one five. This is a vehicle record card which we do our bus checks on. As you can see, there's loads of different things you have to check when you first get on the bus, just to make sure the bus is roadworthy. Doing my checks now. Alright, as you can see, I'm now leaving the depot on today's duty. I've got to go out to service down to the sports village. Morning. When you're a bus driver, it's not just about driving the bus and getting to the destination. Keeping the passengers happy, comfortable, and making sure they're safe. You've got to come into the job with the attitude, treat your passengers the way you would like to be treated. Sometimes it don't work out. They do get stroppy, but you just gotta let that get over, go over your head at the end of the day. You can be as nice as by to some passengers and they still get stroppy with you, but don't rise to the challenge, just stay calm, polite, and explain the situation. Nice, right, here we go.
take extra care when driving the bus because the bus is a lot wider than a car so always keep your eyes open Thank you. Cheers. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Cheers, fella. Thank you. Thank you. So I'm going to change into a number eight now. So before I get around there, I'll change the destination. At the end of your duty, if you've got to take the bus back to the depot, you have to take it into the depot, get it refueled, drive it through the wash and pack it up. This is what I'm about to do now. While it's being refueled, you have to do your last user checks, which has already been explained. Sometimes when you go into the depot, there's a queue to get on the fuel pumps, sometimes there's not. Lucky enough for me, there's no queue. When you're doing the last use, the checks always make sure you shut all the windows as well. Turn the engine off while it's being fueled, and then do my user checks.
This is our canteen inside the depot. Uh, as you can see, it's quite a big canteen. Got a TV on the wall there. Also got a computer over on the right. Another computer on the left to check on the duties. There's Coke vending machine, microwave, toaster, hot water, a few more vending machines for coffee and food. Uh, this is the view out of the window over looking the diesel buses where they park up overnight. This is inside the garage. This is the part, the garage where they repair the buses and do the services on them. This is the pits. More parts of the garage there. As you can see, there's a few buses in here at the moment having a service and being checked out. This is where all the electric buses are packed up, ready for charging. That's the paint shop by there and the body shop. They do all the paint work and the body work. Spraying. The diesel bus is parked up. The bus going through the wash there. You can see it. Depot and start the shift. Well, any time. Come out through here to the bus. Two hundred left. And then you have to come round here, around the back of the hall of buses. Specific plane for you to drive down. So I think it's lane 22. Yeah, lane 22, you see it. That's the lane you drive down to get out with your bus. <laughs> 